Uh, come in. Hello, Mr. Alfonsi. I'm Dr. Clyde. Hey, Doc. How you doing? Yeah, pleasure to meet you. I'm glad you're here. I'm just going to drop this drape on. You might be able to use it to warm yourself up okay. or to preserve a little modesty. Sure. So, welcome to the clinic. I'll be taking care of you today. Okay. And I just want you to let me know how, how you're doing, what brought you here today, what's going on? Well, I got this pain, like, right behind my right knee. Okay. Tell me when that started. Uh, well, it started uh, just after I got off the plane from Italy. Oh, nice. You went to Italy. Yeah, yeah. I went That's there for good. work. Yeah. So, okay. I'm going to ask you a few more questions, okay. then I'll examine you. Then I'll let you know what I think's going on. Okay. Um, but let me find out more about this pain. How intense is it, 1 to 10? Oh, I got a high tolerance for pain, but it's like an 8. Okay. And let me know the quality of it. What does it feel like? Uh, it's like... Uh, like a sharp kind of stabbing pain. And does anything make it better or make it worse? Uh, nothing really makes it better. Uh, I tried ibuprofen, this kind of wore off and then came back even worse than before. Uh, yeah, and then... Uh, it's around your calf, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Not spreading anywhere else? No, no. Okay, okay, good to know. Okay, and let me know a little bit more about the circumstances. So you see, you got off a plane uh -huh. from Rome. So was that a long flight? Oh, yeah, it's like eight and a half hours. That's long, uh -huh. right. I assume something like that. Yeah. Okay, and were you able to get up during the flight and walk around? Oh, no, 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 no. no. I had what a, happened? I have a window seat, and uh, I don't usually like to disturb, uh, uh, you know, the people in my row. You know, one of them says something, and you know, I, I, I kind of have issues with conflict. I get it. I get it. You know, I can relate to that. I used to be that way myself, really. Mm. But it is important to get up and walk around the aircraft because sometimes sitting too long can cause a, an issue that I'm not sure you have, but okay. we're, we're going to find out. Okay. But I'm a little concerned. I'm just going to tell you about a possible clot. We'll see a blood clot. Okay. But okay, so tell me a little bit more. So you got off the plane, uh -huh. and right away you felt this pain. Yeah, and, and I, I kind of thought it was stress, you know, because uh, uh, I had some tomatoes in my bag. And uh, Customs was kind of looking through the bag. You're, you're hiding tomatoes in your bag? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. For work. I, I own a restaurant. Uh, What's the name the, of the place? The original Red Luca. Wait a minute. I love the original Red Luca. Yeah. I bring my kids there all the time. Yeah. Are you the guy throwing the dough? Yeah, that's me. I love your work. Uh, I love excellent. the way you launch. It goes almost to the ceiling. Yeah. Doesn't yeah, touch. Do. Doesn't touch. Then right back down. Yeah. And sometimes I swear your eyes are closed. You are good. I do. I do it sometimes. Yeah. It's crazy. Just for fun, you know. You, you gotta yeah, mix it up a little bit. My kids and I were fans of danger. you. I love yeah. your pizza. It's very crisp. Oh yeah. It good. has that tangy sauce. Yeah. The tomatoes. The tomatoes. The tomatoes. Those juicy red globes were in that bag, wow. and all I could think about was the sauce for the pizza. You know. Yeah. And I'm looking at it. I'm going, oh, 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 I think. Well, it matters. And just so you know, we love your pies. I'm glad. We're coming back in soon. Oh, please, please. Okay, God, I can't believe I'm meeting you. This yeah. is incredible. Okay, the pain. Yeah. Okay, so you had this pain. Right. And then tell me what happened overnight. Were you able to sleep? Oh, no, I couldn't sleep at all. It hurt. I tried to stack up uh, some pillows and kind of put my leg up and didn't do anything. And, uh, yeah, just hurt. So then you came right in here. Yeah. Okay, so I'm going to ask you questions. You can say yes or no to these questions, but they're just kind of about the rest of okay. your body and what's going on with you. Okay. Any headaches? <coughs> nope, nope. Any changes nope. in vision? Nope. Any chest pain? Yeah, a little bit of chest pain this morning. I had some chest pain. Okay. Any oh. shortness of breath? Yeah. Any coughing? A little bit, but not too much. Any <clears throat> joint pains in your extremities, the rest of the body, no, any no. muscular pains? No, just All right. right How's here. your urination? Is that all right? That's fine. How about your bowel habit? That's fine, yeah. Okay. Pipes are clean. <laughs> <laughs> I like that one, Mr. Alphonse. Yeah. I like it. Hey, feel free to use it, you know. All right, you I, I that might, one. I might. That's a good one. All right, so tell me a little bit more about your social situation. Where are you living? Who are you living with? Are you married? Oh, yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm married. I'm married 20 years. All right. Uh, I got three beautiful kids. Now hey, congratulations. Good to me. Yeah. Yeah. Mr. Alfonsi, everything we say is confidential in this room. Okay. So I need to ask you some personal questions. Okay. Are you sexually active right now? Uh, yeah, 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 you know. Is it with your wife? Yes, yes. Okay. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. I'm Catholic. You think I'm going to carry around that guilt? Makes sense. <laughs> so how about alcohol? Are you drinking alcohol? Uh, yeah. Barolo with a pie? Are you kidding me? Who wouldn't want that? Right? That's like a perfect evening. 
You sit down with one of mm. your pies and a wine like that. Mm -hmm. God, now you got to come in. You got to come gonna in. I'm going to come in. I'm going to yeah. come in. Yeah. Now you... that we're meeting, I'm coming in. Okay, good. All right. So I have to ask you also about illicit drugs, recreational drugs. You're using any of those? Uh, no, no. I mean, you know, in college, a little bit of, you know, a little bit of that. But, you know, nothing, nothing too crazy. Okay. Know. What about your your family history? Does anyone in your family have you heard of the word clot in your family? Oh, clot. Clot. Yeah. Uncle Giuseppe had a clot. Okay. Yeah. Tell me about that. Uh, well, I don't know. He went into the hospital. Though all the cousins came over and stayed at our place uh, for like a week. He was in there, probably a month. Okay, that's really helping me out. That information. Okay. Mr. Alfonsi, Frank, is it okay if I call you Frank? Yeah, please. Okay, I'd love to be on a first name basis with <laughs> the owner and the dough thrower of the Red Luca. The original, the, the original, original Red, Red Luca. Luca. So oh, the wait, other wait, people wait, trying wait. to you, use... You go to the other Red Luca. No, I wouldn't. Don't go to the I other wouldn't. Red Luca. No, you're... The I'm original the Red Luca. I see them trying to use your and name. They try to use the name. Yeah, we have, a, we have a little... We have words about that. You got lawyers? It's more or less, yeah. Okay, all right. So you're doing something about it. Yeah, we're it's doing something shame, about it. It's a shame what people will do these days. Yeah. All right, so now I'd like to examine you, and maybe I can find out exactly what's happening. I already have a good idea of what's possibly going on. Okay. But I'm going to start off by cleaning my hands, and then I'm going to check your lymphs. So lymph nodes, I look for anything swollen, and I don't find it there. Okay. And I'm checking your head, too. Now I'm going to untie your gown. And do me a favor. Mm -hmm. Just lower your gown down to your waist so I can examine your heart. Sure. I'd like to get a listen to that heart. OK. OK, you can lift your gown up. And now I'm coming around back here so I can check your lungs. All right, just tapping on them. Now I'm going to listen to them. Do me a favor and breathe in and out. In and out. Again. And one more time. Okay, so I see you're a little short of breath. Yeah, it's making me a little dizzy doing yeah, it. Yeah, and you told me you had chest pain. So I'm tying your gown back up for you. Okay. And we're almost done with this. It's going to be a quick physical. And I really do have some idea about what's going on with you. Stay right there if okay. you would. And um, lift up that drape a little so I can see your knees. And I'm just going to check your reflex, check your reflex, check, check. Okay. And now the other thing I want to do is I want to make sure you can still feel this. Can you feel that? Oh, yeah. And can you feel this? Yeah. Okay, that's good. And now the next thing is, I'm going to test some of your sensory um, response. So this okay. is sharp. Okay. Sharp feels like that. Yep. And dull feels like this. Close okay. your eyes for me. Okay. And what do you feel on the left? Sharp. And what do you feel on the right? Sharp. Okay. And what do you feel on the top of your foot? Dull. Okay. And what do you feel on the top of this foot? Dull. Okay, good. All right. So now, if you would, lie down here for me. Okay. Okay. And I am going to lift up this leg. Okay. And when I do so, I'm going to dorsiflex. Any pain there? No. Okay, that's good. So now, this is the affected leg, and I'm going to examine it. I want to palpate first the good leg. And that one looks fine, looks very normal. Now I'm going to check this leg. And what I feel is a lot of warmth. I know I can feel something here. Does that hurt yeah. when I press on that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah. I actually feel a protrusion. All right, what we call that is a rope, and the rope is possibly a clot. Okay. So now I'm going to do a pretty good test on you that will tell me some more, and you just tell me if this hurts. Okay. Ho oh, man! Okay, and you know what? What you just said? Ho oh, man. That was home and sign, and you were positive for that. And I positive want you to good, right? Mm, not in this case. Okay. So I want you to sit up here and dang your legs over that side. And let me tell you what I think is happening. I think you have a clot. Okay. And it's called a DVT. And what I want to do is treat that immediately. It means deep vein thrombosis. Okay. And what happened in this case, I'm pretty certain, is you had that long plane flight. Uh -huh. You were sitting there for so long. You didn't get up to get the blood flowing, so it stayed in that area. But I also think you might have a blood disorder, because okay. you told me your Uncle Giuseppe had that. Yeah, and yeah, they're yeah, really so. familial, so I think it might have passed along to you. Okay. 
So I don't want you to be concerned, but now this is an acute emergency case. So I'm going to get you right down to the ER. Got it. And we're going to do a Doppler ultrasound, okay. a test for D-dimer, okay. and then uh, we'll get you right on some anticoagulants if need be. But I'm pretty certain that's what's going on. Okay. And I will be in touch with you this whole time. And I think you came to the right place and you came quick enough for us to really respond to this. Okay, good. Okay? Yeah, yeah. So um, do you have any questions for me? What's, what's a D-dimer? What's D-dimer? Oh, D-dimer. that will tell me how much clotting is going on in your blood. Now, the reason we're going so fast to get this taken care of is you told me you had shortness of breath and chest pain. Yeah. And I'm concerned it might be moving to your lungs. We call that a pulmonary embolism. Okay. And I don't want you to get one. I think you might have the very incipient beginning stages of one. Okay. And that I don't want the clot to organize there because that's very dangerous. Yeah. So we want to happen is we treat it quickly, yeah. we get on top of it, and you get better as quickly as you can. Okay. All right, so I'm going to be in close touch with okay. you. It was my pleasure. Thank you, Doc. I can't Thank believe so I got much. to meet you. Yeah, come and in. I, yeah, come I, in. I see us Bring having, the kids in. Yeah, okay? I see us having some pie and yeah. watching some dough throwing yeah, yeah. very soon. Okay. All right. Thank you so much. Thanks, Doc. Take care, Frank. I'll, I'll be in right. touch. Thanks.